We just found out some big news. So Alyssa woke me up this morning. Actually, I woke up at 5.30, 5.45 this morning. Yeah, because you had all those dang alarms go off. Yeah, so I got up early. I was sitting here drinking my coffee. And I was like, I don't feel good. So I was like, I'm going to go just go back to bed. I'm trying to go to sleep. And Alyssa just comes and sits on the bed. Heath, I need you to sit up. And she just <laughs> hands me the pregnancy test. <laughs> It legit scared all of the uh, excited, <laughs> scared out everything out of me. And so, we're gonna have a baby. <laughs> <laughs> but just to make sure, um, we're gonna to, go to the clinic. We're gonna go to the clinic inside of the Canadian superstore today. <laughs> I should have filmed telling you. It's okay. I guess I wasn't worried. I will never forget it. Yeah. Yeah. The other thing we were talking about this morning, cause like in my mind, I start going through all these various scenarios. Like, what are we gonna do? There's so many things I don't know about babies. And also it's like, do we want to have a baby in an RV? Like, do we need to go that's get a- the, That's the biggest decision, right? Because, well, we've been in such a small rig for this whole year, basically, that to get back in our Winnebago and have a baby, like a it's going to feel like a mansion. It's going to feel huge. It's like there's so much room in there. Two slide outs, 33 feet. 33 feet. <laughs> it's luxury. All right, you want to plug in the grocery store? Yeah. There's a little itty bitty baby in there somewhere. If we go to the do the other test and it comes back negative, this is going to be the most depressing thing. This is going to be... Even though it day. seems like we're slightly freaking out, we're so excited. We're so excited. <laughs> we gave ourselves five years from when we first got married. We said, hey, in five years, that's when we want to start a family. We want to spend as much time as we can on adventures and traveling together and having quality time with us. And I'd be due a week before our anniversary. Yeah, our five year anniversary. <laughs> Everything is about to change. In case we need more drama this morning, we can't actually figure out how to get into the parking lot for the super shore. We're currently in a uh... GMC parking lot. Yeah, right now, now we're at like a Chevy dealership, so great. Really great. This has been the longest drive of my life, getting to this grocery store. Oh, finally a green arrow. Ready? Yeah. I mean, not emotionally ready, but I am physically have shoes on at least. The real Canadian superstore where baby dreams come true. <laughs> I have to say, of all the scenarios I thought through of finding out for sure if we were having a baby, never thought it would be in a Canadian grocery store. <laughs> I guess if we need to indulge any cravings, like this is actually a good place if you need some chocolate or afterwards. I can have some chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> What'd they say? Said come back in like an hour and a half, so I'm just gonna freak out for a while. Because we have this massive grocery store to wander around in that's also like a mall and a pharmacy and a yeah. medical clinic. So cute. Just walking down these aisles, I realized there's so many things that I have no idea about. We got this, we can figure this out. We just got back in the RV, it's an hour and a half wait time. Now we torturously wait, if that's even a word. We're just gonna sit here for an hour and a half. We should like watch a movie or something. Pass the time. <laughs> 
five hours later. Oh my gosh, I can only waste so much time. <laughs> it's been a little over an hour. It's time to go see the Longest results. Longest hour of my life. <laughs> We're about to walk in and get the results. All right, what happened? He said there's still 16 people ahead of us. So we have a lot of time to kill. So I guess we'll just go hang out in the rig and have the work day in the parking lot. Yeah. And pretend like I can focus on anything. Of all the days for the clinic at the grocery store to be completely packed. Well, of course it's today. This is now officially the longest day of my life. <laughs> ever going to call us back. We're just gonna sit here in pregnancy limbo. They just called us. We have two people ahead of us. Come on inside. My heart's beating really fast. Yeah mine too. I just don't like I need a I need a doctor. And then then it'll be real. Right now I'm just in this state of emotional limbo. You need limbo. them to say you're pregnant. And then I feel like then I can be like <laughs> then I'll do that. Take is, number three. It is nice that they told us we could go wait outside versus like just sitting in that waiting room for the two and a half hours that we've been waiting. That would have been brutal. It was brutal no matter what. Emotionally stressful <laughs> and overwhelming. Oh, all right, let's do this. <laughs> it's just not flat. It's not level. <laughs> you nervous? Very <laughs> And it looks like you are pregnant. So, just to clarify, she is pregnant. Yeah, so, yeah, you gotta know, right? I mean, um, oh, okay, you, 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 you want to keep the baby, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So August fifth, right? Uh huh. So that makes you literally. The doctor like walks in holding his laptop, and he's just like. Okay, so yeah, yeah, you're pregnant, and uh, so, and just like he was talking, and I'm like. He what? said you definitely got yourself pregnant. <laughs> like, did I just hear that? What? The wait was worth it. We're gonna have a baby. <laughs> oh my god. I am pregnant <laughs> with a baby. Hopefully this one. I hadn't even considered that it could be. We don't need their twins, run. Yeah, family. yeah. Well, the wait was worth it. Where you're going? <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe this. I'm pumped. <laughs> Terrified. I don't feel old enough to have a baby. Well, no, you'll be a year older when it comes. <laughs> we gotta figure out where we wanna live. Can we kill that skeeter? I am a mother now. I can't just go around killing things. I, I feel like everything else just all of a sudden 100% took a back burner. Like, oh we're, yeah, totally. We're here for a campground booking and getting work done and visiting campgrounds and customers and stuff. And I'm like, none of that matters. Like, Just the baby. Yeah. <laughs> Baby. Let's do it. Okay. I mean, we already did it, but. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Let me just look at this one last time. That still says positive. <laughs>